guys, JC Hooligan, coming from the Dirty Jers with another episode of Ark Island Extension CE modded map. Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a great day. Thank you guys for all your support, likes, and comments on the last video. Uh, it was kind of a disaster in that uh, little cave. I'm not going to lie. And Caveman is aware. He is the mod dev. He is aware of the situation with the uh, rock golem, lava golem guy. Because I would like to do that boss fight sometime on camera. At some point, we're definitely going to do that. So, uh, I'm standing out here on the gazebo. I thought it might be a nice place to start. And you might notice all the little dits and dots floating around me in an area. Uh, I was playing around with the lighting table. And check this out, these little discs. It's freaking glow bugs, lightning bugs, man. You can like make lightning bugs and stuff. Uh, so, I added those because I thought it would be pretty neat here. We also need to add some lighting. We still need to add a gas collector. Uh, of which we need red gems. And I want to say we're just going to... With the lag. We're just going to zoop. And I added some lighting outside because it was freaking dark. I kind of... The base is growing on me. It's a bit It's a bit of a busy box of all this stuff and things lying about the area. We were finally joined by Ruthless, so we have, like, the full house going on. Loaf's online. We're going to say hi to him real quick. Like, hello. And that's good. Uh, let's go check here and see what kind of red the red gem situation is looking like. Uh, 12 in here. 12 in here, I said. Give me those. And another 12 in here. I'll take those. We got oil for days. Let's go ahead and grab all this oil. And we'll just throw in the oil tank because that's where it goes. Check it out. We have an oil tank. Listen. Boom. I love it. I absolutely love it. Let's just go ahead and throw all this in there. I mean, <laughs> I don't think it auto-collects oil, but, you know, it is a thing. And I'm going to go ahead and throw some of the stuff in my items, stuff and things, because it's not really that big of a deal. Uh, we ta we dyed up our armor because we needed to, uh, as you can see. Oh, God. Uh, I thought you, 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 you. Oh, my God. I almost had the whole place going nuts. Everybody calm down. Oh, the wrong button. It's a terrible disaster. Flyers land. Everybody just land. Everybody calm down. Oh my god, that was almost a whole thing right there. You got all kinds of levels on you, don't you? 36 levels. Let's go ahead and put some into there. Like so. Let's go ahead and put some into that fat weight. Like so. Uh, you're not the best bird ever, but you're going to be one of the fastest birds on the planet. Oh my god. And you might be a little bit strong. How fast are you now? Ooh, blazing fast for an RG. Oh my god, even you. What are you doing up there, man? Yeah, boy, well, you just land somewhere. Yeah, you look good right there, homie. So as I was saying, I want to add some lighting up there. It's not quite centered, but you didn't look at that. Don't look at that. Don't mind, don't mind that. And we still need to get you guys put away because I can't. Oh, what would you have in your inventory, my dude? Uh, Nothing great. Nothing that we need, like, just dramatically so. Oh, I love that door. It's a little buggy sometimes. You can walk right through it at times, but, you know, it is what it is. I don't think this mod's been updated by that. this mod I'm talking about, the mod I'm currently looking at, the uh, Steampunk mod. I don't think it's been updated for a minute. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Gems. Truly outrageous. Uh, has. I think we're going to need a ton of these. Oh, wait. Why was I thinking? Oh, no, the, the gas collector, duh. That's what I was trying to build. No, no, that's not it. Um... Wait, where is this stupid thing built at? I forgot. You guys, I can't remember. Gas collector. Smithy. Oh, red gems twenty in a smithy. Oh, I think we got this. I think we got this. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna collect some gas. Gas. Full. Build. Done. Taking. Checkmate. All right, let's go. Let's go slap this on there and start making some gas, you guys. I don't know if I've updated it in the I and I settings. Uh, let's just go ahead and pop, get this thing ready to pop, plop down right there. Yeah, that's right. You go right there. Oh, look, it's already damaged. Isn't that crazy? It takes damage as soon as you stick it there. But I'm into it. I'm excited. Uh, we're gonna start collecting. Oh, look at the little thing. I've never. I don't know if I've ever placed one of these in my entire life. Uh, I've been on Aberration plenty of times. And the reason I want this thing, um, well, several reasons. First, let me show you. There's all these extra caves from all these extra zones and regions. And you got some hot level action on you, too. When did you get 120,000 HPs? I don't even remember, man. Yep, yep. Squawk, squawk. 
Bok bok. All right, let me show you. Check this out. We're gonna go down like so. Polar Truidon. Look right here. There is an aberration cave right here. However, if we go inside, we immediately start taking the old rad damage. There's freaking oil in here. See? Click, 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 click. Instantaneous, we start taking damage. There's all kinds of neat stuff in here. I want to explore this cave so very badly. Is there another opening over there? Get out of here. Hold on. Now I'm curious. I mean, it's not like we could sneak past the radiation. That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to figure out. Is I see an extra opening over there. And if we tame an aberration dino. All right, that's the visqueen right there. All right, let's go up like so. I'm super curious now. You guys, is this a thing? I felt like, because I know there's like weird little inlets and outlets down this area. Oh, excuse me, tree. No, that must just be the inner workings. I bet that whole cave system's in this area right here where I'm looking at to my left, immediately on my left. So, I think this is just a hole by the house. Sure is. So I'm wondering if we tamed up any of the ab dinos, will they will they be okay inside there? Um, it looked like a fairly large cave. Who's over here that is tameable? Oh, and I also want to get into farming today as well. Aberrant dinosuchus. Uh, none of oh 540. I was gonna say none of them are great, but that's that's pretty freaking impressive. Um, I feel like what's down here. What are you? Aberrant equus. All things being equus. Hey yo, jokes for days. Not good ones. They're just jokes. Um. Ooh, there's oh level 100 carquinos. Hey stupid. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna eat your bits. Oh my god, we got the prime meats for days. 540. You get to live. Shiny skeletal titanoboa has been killed. Who killed it? This dude's just hanging out. He's like, I saw you kill my friends. I'm just gonna, I'm cool right here, bro. All right. All right. Another level. Put that in your melee damage. I'm gonna make you a killer. Um, <laughs> I got good frame rate until we get to the base. And then it's like, pfft, splat. Uh, so I want to build a greenhouse. I want to get into the farming stuff and the farming and the things. And you know, I'm kind of feeling like, I kind of like this uh, walkway situation we have going up here. Now, it's going to be labor intensive, so I'm curious. Uh, if we actually branch off and build an elevated um, greenhouse, would that look cool? Like, let me know in the down there. I'm kind of feeling it. Um, but to build the copper stuff and things, I mean, it, it's copper plates for days. However, and I don't know if I showed you guys this. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. All right, you guys. This is the copper hand drill, right? I wish I could use it while I was in K-Mode. That would be amazing. All right, all we gotta do is go over to a metal node and this thing harvests up copper for days. Look at this, watch this. This is absolutely insane, you guys. Let's go ahead and, I'm probably gonna get too fast to walk here in a second. Oh no, I can do it. I'm totally walking. How many did we get? Oh my God, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. What? What is that? 3,000, 6,000. And, I don't know, 7,500 altogether? Is my math correct? I'm not sure. Somebody, math, math, math majologist down there. Let me know in the down there. So, yeah, now we have tons of this stuff. So we can make the copper plates for days. See how the, the thing goes down? Watch. I'll show you guys how we can walk through it now. Watch this. Bloop. So, for some reason, now it's down. And it's going to be up as soon as I hit it again. And there we go. Now I want to put all of this bits and stuff and things in here. Any glass in here? No, we got plenty of you. So we need to make some glass. We got some glass in here. All right, I need to get some. I need to get on. I need to get. I need to get some words in my mouth. Uh, plant. Oh my God, we got the copper for days. It's the glass situation that we're not looking good on. Um, I need to find crystal. Actually, you know what? We can keep all this stuff because it's all usable stuff and things. Oh man, so all this stuff came out of the ground. We're running low on stone. Holy crap. Stone stitch is not good. Um. Can we burn some wood, metal? I feel like we should pull some wood into the situation. I'm into it. How about 2,500? Pull done. Problem is it's gonna start making those as well because I think there's, yeah, yeah, that's a thing. That's okay, we can do that. It's perfectly fine. 
All right, let's pull some more wood because this thing makes um uh metal like a boss. Uh, all right, so that's the thing there. How are we looking on ingots? 7,900? Not too bad. All right, guys, let me see if I can round up some crystals, start crafting up some glass of all burbs. And we are back. And there's something I needed to add that I was told is in here. So we're going to see what this is. All right, we're going to place it, right? No, nope, that's not the one we wanted. Um, oh, Hold on now. Select banner. <gasps> oh, baby. Wait, that didn't work. Oh, swing and a miss. Oh, you guys, there it is. There's the Jersey Devil. JC Hooligan. We have a flag, courtesy of Gunner Does Games. Uh, we're going to go hang out with Loaf real quick. Uh, he's one of the guys that plays on the server as well. We're going to go see about his stuff and things. He built an epic base, you guys. I wanted to show it off a little bit. I mean, we'll do a little tour. Uh, oh, the water looks creepy weird. I was like, what is happening in there? All right, let's take a look here. Loaf's master project work in progress. Or... All right, we're going to go to this one first. I don't know which one it is. We're going to find out. Hey, yo, guys. We're over here at Loaf's new house that he just built. Hello. Out of the CKF mod. So it's pretty freaking dope, man. Um, To be... Uh, a full disclosure, I tried to do this earlier, and it failed epically. So we're going to do it again. Uh, we're going to give you guys a tour of his new base that he just built. Uh, This is the main area, correct? Yeah. This is the main building area. Awesome. Take us around. What do we got going on in here? For the main part, over here's the main crafting stuff, and plus immersive taming in the corner. This is all GDG mod stuff, right? Yep. All gunners. Nice. Another nice. person in the server. He is. He is. He built me my neat flag. All the... And look at this organization, you guys. He's got extra stuff and things over here. All of his resources in here. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Does this refrigerate too? No, it doesn't. Okay, I was like, no, what? I just, I just shoved a bunch of stuff in there. Okay, cool. I was like, oh man, that would have been way too cool. What is this over? Oh, what? I don't think I've ever built a CKF forge in my life. This is awesome. They are actually much cheaper since it costs raw metal, not ah, cooked. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. Also, uh, here you go. Let's <laughs> just. Uh, yeah. You know what? I'll take all these. Screw it, man. I'll put them in my base. <laughs> <laughs> this is all from the Anki World building. Oh my god! I need mayhole berries. None of these. All right. So where, where are we going next? Show us the next stuff and things. So this is all CKF. I see the glass. And the CKF modded guys is it's not an easy mod to build with. It really isn't. It's uh, a pain. Figuring out what is what because if you guys haven't used it before, a lot of these things you don't know what they are because doors and walls are in the same menu sometimes and. The door frame is in a wall section, and the door is... Uh, it's, 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 a, it's a bitch, I'm not going to lie. And this is the There's... peasant or, or villager? Which one is this one? This is the village one. God, this is so cool. I love this two-door look. You know, I feel like, though, like they should have done, instead of just straight-up lines like that, I wonder, actually... Oh, God, yeah, there's a million frame variants. I was like, you could probably do, like, X frames or something. Uh, but yeah, so this is going to be the house, obviously. Oh, we got the elevators stuff and things going in. I love the look of stairs, but the elevators are so much more convenient. Um, placing them is kind of a nightmare as well. You got a bush in your house, man. I keep trying to get rid of the bushes. They either keep respawning or just appearing. There's got to be something in one of the mods. I have never changed any of the... Holy crap, is this like a inaccessible floor <laughs> how do we get out i'm I... stuck also danger noodle um <laughs> danger noodle for the moment uh i'm gonna tear your wall come here get out <laughs> hold oh. on hold on let me let me put my are you gonna grapple me i was but i try again let go there you go oh i'm stuck nope i tried all right, I can grapple my way out of here. No worries. <laughs> Grappling my way out. It's amazing. Wait, tools? What if Grapple. I just trap you down there? You can't, man. <laughs> yeah, I can. Oh, yeah? Okay. okay, take a wall down. I did. <laughs> just okay. replace the wall. <laughs> I'm taking it with me. 
taxes are due. All right. I can make another. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh, God. That was the longest. Really? Am I stuck now? Yes. Yes, you are. Simply because these are too high to just jump off. I know. They're crazy big. They're, are these double uh, double road? Uh, Yes. They are double road. Oh, for some so I don't know how you keep falling off them or whatever. Because <laughs> it's me, man. <laughs> All right, let's Clumsy. go take a look at uh, the greenhouse now. So this is the GDG water fountain, and it you guys don't know, no, this thing has an area of effect, so it's watering all of his crop plots. The HG and Seed Crafter. The main planting system, which was a pain to set up, but it works perfect. Speaking of, I need to clean this out. And this takes all the, the already made crops, correct? Yes. Anything that grows within a crop pot, it just takes. So we've got the poop maker, which then gets sucked into the uh, this thing to make the fertilizer. Then the fertilizer gets sucked into the fertilizer tank and then gets automatically distributed. Yep. Oh, my God. It's all automated, you guys. How crazy is that? Thank Gunner. Yeah, Gunner, that's it's amazing. The whole reason. So cool. Oh, He's my God. Are you, are you growing redwoods, too? Uh, sap. Oh, word. Sap, obsidian, rare flowers, both pearls, crystal. Unbelievable. Organic yeah. polymer. Yep. I forget what this did. I think that's oil or something. Uh, if I would have put the HG mod in, they actually have a, um, if you have, like, some snails, it'll automatically capture their paste, or you can put them in there and it'll automatically... Yeah, but there's a that. soul terminal for that. Yeah, exactly. That's what I do too. Soul terminal. Well, man, this space is pretty cool, dude. I really, I'm really blown away by this whole thing. Got your egg hatching station. Oh, and the blood stalker, which we saw earlier, uh, which he caught with the immersive tame. Uh, dude, it's a high level one too, man. That was there was a 540 running around on one of the trees I saw earlier. Uh, this guy's dope, man. This this is a cool base. And then you also have the the rhino bug, right? We saw I missed it hatch. I missed it on on camera. We totally didn't get it. Oh wait, the chem station. What does this thing do? Oh, it's just a fancy. Uh, wait, what? Wait, that, come that to me. Come to me. And look up. I'm looking up. Find you. Oh my God! You got a infestation. You got bugs everywhere, dude. Oh, that's awesome. And I'll be having more soon. Dude, where did you find it? I didn't even see him on the map yet. I saw a level 100 I got. Where was he chilling? Uh, in the swamp, where they always are. Oh, I didn't even know where they spawned. All right, that's going to be a thing we're going to do. This Hold guy up. is so cool. Let me just. I see you've got a tracker on him. <laughs> yes, soon because I'm going to have him up there. And they make, they make submitting paste or something? Uh, you put sap in and they create resin. And what do you do with the resin? What? Oh, what? Oh, man. Gross. Ew, I've been gooed on. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, my God. Yeah, I've heard they can carry, like, everything, dude. This is nuts. Bronto, Giga, Karchar, and Titano are, like, the only things they can't. That's so crazy. And Wyverns. Yeah, obviously. I think flyers then can't be picked up. Yo, loaf, uh, cotton candy here is uh, looking pretty dope, dude. Twelve hundred nineteenth level. My God, man. That was a seven twenty egg. Full that of just full, full of leech blood. Are you about to impregnate this bad hombre? No, this is mine. I <sighs> took it to the swamp because I was looking for a shiny. Gotcha. Oh, that's awesome, man. Well, dude, thank you so much for the tour. Um, we'll get this up in the video, and we will showcase your base in the next vid. So, dude, I really appreciate it, man. And uh, if I need some pearls, yeah. I'm going to come over and steal a handful or two. <laughs> probably, some, I... probably some crystal when I start building my greenhouse. Uh, so, ahead, awesome. Take... <laughs> All right, take buddy. As, take as many as you want. Sounds good, man. Thanks so much. Mm-hmm. All right, gang, and we are back from the tour of Loaf's base. I wasn't expecting that, but that was really cool. What a clean base. Uh, look at that. We're running through the thing. It's a little annoying. That needs to be fixed, but all right. I uh, really like his base. Uh, he's done a great job with that, and we got we need, to, we need to clean the floors in here, man. We got fungus growing in our house. Uh, let's see. Are we good with that? All right, we're going to start crafting up some copper plates because 
we're going to need them in a bad way. You know, let's just get them going. I don't care. Usually I like to stagger them so that they keep building no matter when there's no gaps, but whatever. We're going to build as many as we can. Oh my god, so many. All right, copper plates are being made. Um, we have some copper plates already produced. We'll scrap those 239 right there. We'll, we'll hatch this Magmasaur egg at another time, uh, maybe another episode. Oh yeah, let's craft up all the stuff. What else is in here? Anything, 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 anything good? Nah, we're good, it's clean. We should probably be making it do something, but we're busy. Um, let's dump this. Uh, he's got great organization over there. Everything looks good. He's got a really clean base. Uh, he's a younger player, but he really kills it on the old arc, man. I, I gotta say, he's a great, great player. Uh, good addition to the server. Uh, okay, so, as I was saying, we need to get some ceilings going on. And I don't know, like, how many can we build? 65? You know what? I feel like at least... Let's start with 35. Get that going first. Ooh, creepies! Oh, he's up there. <laughs> I heard the door. I was like, what's happening? Oh, the window is so clean. I was going to walk through the wall like an idiot. Uh, all right, man. I'm going to craft this up, you guys. We'll get some stuff done. We need to get some pillars built. Uh, this does take quite a while. So in the meantime, while that's happening, hmm, you know what? I, I feel like we need to hop over here and see if we can build these. Um, is it fertilizer? Is it in here? No. Uh, poop? No. No, not no, absolutely not. Uh, let's figure out where this stuff is crafted. So it's crafted over here in Gunner's stuff. So let's go see which one it is. Is it this guy? Is this the one that builds all the cool stuff? Structures? Farming! It is! Compost bin. Water well. Mystic crystal. Poop maker. It's just fun to say. Fertilizer! Silo! Pulls fertilizer from the compost bin and sends to any vanilla-based crop plot. What? Planter. Structure. All right. So we've got stuff to do. Fish farm. Place this at the bottom and it'll automatically raise wild fishes in the area that you can kill for meat. Also produces pearls. Oh, baby. All right. So this is the compost bin. All right. So we need to get the poop maker. So this is... The, you know what? Let's just let's just take this into the house. Why wouldn't we? Let's go ahead and pick this bad ombre up. Oh, what was in there? Anything? Oh, scissors and paintbrush. Okay, we'll take those. All right. This will make the outside a little cleaner. This is a wooden crate. I don't know what's in it, but that's a thing. I'm stealing this from you, Gunner. We're taking it in the house. Look upstairs. We're running out of space. The house is so small. Um... The house, I felt like, was pretty big at one time. All right. How's about... Oh, it's sexy. It even looks kind of nice right here, I'll be honest. The wood grain is amazing. All right, so we wanted... Oh, taming? What did we have in there? Trank ammo? Oh, my God, you guys. All right, we'll play with some of that later. Um, Tools? What do we got in here? Okay, these are all the stuff in the things. Uh, it looks like... All right, that's cool. Uh, let's get into structures. Kitchen? Fridge, industrial grill, disco fridge, and the cauldron. So epic. Crafting, S meat spoiler, a cinder. What? The oil pump. That's the thing that's running. Uh, infinite oil when active. Placed anywhere. Oh my god. Uh, oh, speaking of, we have our oil pump pumping in the desert and we haven't checked it in like ages and a half. Oh my god, guys. There's so many things with this mod. All right, let's. Let's focus. Poop maker. I'm into it. Crystal. Um, oh my god, that's a lot of crystal. Ooh, 2,500? I think that just used up all our spare crystal. This guy. Alright, so now we have... And then we need this guy. Uh, and we're going to use the water thing. How much is that? I think we can do it. Oh yeah, we got it. Oh, baby. I'm into it. Okay, cool. So th that's the thing. So now let's go see if our other stuff is crafted up. And we're going to have to build pillars. And again, guys, building with steampunk is, of course, labor intensive and takes forever. Pillar. You know what? We might have to. Let's build, I don't know, 20 of these bad hombres. 
Oh, we got this. We got 20. We got plenty of stuff in here. All right, cool. All right, those build a little bit faster. All right, let's go ahead and put this stuff in the prefabbed stuff and the prefabbed things in here like so. All right, cool. So that's the thing. All right, guys, it's going to take a few minutes and I'll burbs. All right, gang. So I just want to bring you back on some of the progress. Uh, slowly but surely, we're going to build a wide spot up here to add our greenhouse stuff and things. So what do we have here? So I want to do five wide, and I think I want to do maybe six deep. So three more rows, and this is the way the, the pillars are going to go for the foundations. Um, but I think it's going to look pretty cool. Uh, it's going to be slow process, slow going, so I'm not going to make you guys sit with me through the most excruciating building process of all time. But I really like this ex elevated uh, setup. So we're going to keep on this, and uh, we'll bring you guys back in when we have this thing built. And we're back, you guys. Uh, this is the platform. Let me show you here. I went in and added a huge bunch of steps so we get up the back side. I added this just to balance that out. Now I kind of need to feel like I need to add two more in here to balance that out as well. Uh, but I'm feeling like the glass part itself is going to run along the inside like this. So we have this lip kind of walkway thing around the outside edge. Uh, I was going to end it right here, but now I feel like I just need to add those two right there. So we're going to do that real quick. Zoop. Oh, I thought we I thought we'd clear the rail. We did not. Dang it, Bobby. Um, so that was a thing we did not do. Let's just go ahead and pop these last two ceiling bits in here and get those done. One, two, done. Um, I wish the dev would release the INI &I settings so we could speed up the crafting uh, on these things because it is slow, man. Ca I don't know if you guys know this. If you've ever built with steampunk, it is super, super grindy. Um, it takes forever to get things built. Uh, <laughs> let's go ahead and just finish that. All right, awesome. Um. I'm gonna have to play around and see what kind of greenhouse mods and settings that I currently have. Uh, I want to use the cleanest, cleanest, clearest glass possible. Uh, so that is a thing I will be doing as well. But I think that's gonna do it for this episode, you guys. So thank you so much for coming to hang out with us today. Thanks for coming along with me on my tour of Loaf's awesome new base. Uh, the new flags, I went ahead and added a second one so it's a little more balanced. Whoa! Lag and a float. So there is the base. The JC Hooligan flags, I evened them out a little more. Let's make sure I don't run off the world. Uh, I really am liking how this is coming along, you guys. This is super great. Uh, I gotta be honest, dude. The copper pillars, other than these little glitches they do, are probably the coolest looking pillars in all of the entire our entirety of Ark. We'll get some more lighting put up and get this thing going. But I'm really liking how this compound is coming along. So again, you guys, thank you so much for all your support, all your comments. Everything has been a big thing. Don't forget to come check us out on twitch.tv slash jchooligan on Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Uh, if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe. Feel free to share a favorite video as you see fit. JC Hooligan signing out. And as always, you have a great yeah. rest of your day.